We're looking at the multiplication table lab. Now, I have this in a project called Molt Table Lab. The uh, package is Molt Table Lab all lowercase. You can see it right there. So just make sure both uh, Drawing Panel and Molt Table Lab have the package correct. Now that I'm looking at it, uh, there's a lot of T's and a lot of L's, um, but just I usually just copy and paste it. And of course you can copy and paste it right out of here. If you slowly click twice, you can copy that. So drawing panel should, you shouldn't have to edit it other than making sure it's in the right package. Multiple lab, this is what you get. And what you need to do, let's, well, first let's look at what's in here. So I make a new drawing panel, set the background, um, get the graphics, and I set the color back to black. Uh, these are the defaults, so you don't have to have those in there. Uh, and one thing I did differently here, I knew I was going to use the drawing panel in several places outside of public static void main. So what I did, instead of declaring drawing panel like you typically would right here, what I did is I declared it outside of the main method. I declared it above. And what that allows you to do is you can access panel from anywhere inside of the class. So I can access panel from any of my methods. You don't necessarily need to access panel, but definitely graphics you're going to use over and over and over again. Right now, there is a warning. Local variable hides a field. So up here, if you declare variables outside of methods, they're called fields. They're still variables, but they have a different name for them and they're called fields. And what that means is you can access them in any method as long as you're inside of this class. And you can see you start at the curly bracket here, then you create these two fields and anywhere inside this block here that starts with the curly brace, both of these fields exist. And right now, when I put drawing panel in front of panel, it's like I'm declaring something again. You sh uh, shouldn't use the name of the class. So this panel is a drawing panel, but if I put drawing panel in front of it, NetBeans thinks I'm creating a new variable that's different from this. Now they have the same name, so that's a little bit of a trouble. And the way uh, Java deals with it, the local variable will hide the field up top. So this panel is actually hiding this one. It's very easy to unhide it. Uh, there's two ways you can do it. I only want one panel, so I just don't declare it on line 27. I just set it and use it. Uh, so line 27, I set it. Line 28, I use it. I do the same thing with G, where I uh, get the graphics, set the color. In this, I do a double zoom because I want to be able to read it very easily. And also because I'm recording this, I want you to be able to see it, especially if you're on a, a smaller screen like a phone. So that is how fields work. Later on, I'm going to want a height and a width because when we create this multiplication table, uh, we're going to think in terms of cells or blocks. Uh, and so this, these variables here, these fields here will let us use height and width wherever we want in this code and not have to declare them locally.